Dear Diary, my name is Elizabeth Bennett, but you may call me Lizzie. I look something like this, I guess. Dear Diary, it's not easy being a Bennett. The girls Kitty and Lydia tear the house down. Mary broods all day. Mother is mad. The only sane ones are Father and Jane, to be honest. Dear Diary, there are new people in town, and Mother keeps nagging for us to get married. Again, I know. Though, if you ask me, nobody stands a chance except for Jane. Dear Diary, today we went to the ball to meet the new people. And so I met Mr. Darcy. You would not believe how arrogant he is. He insulted my appearance and flat out refused to dance with me. Well, I care not for him. He is stuck up and I shall not talk of him again. On a happier note, Mr. Bingley and Jane seem to have taken to each other magnificently. Dear Diary, Mother sent Jane to Mr. Bingley's house by horse, knowing she would get stuck in the rain. I went to see her, of course, and she is sick now. Thanks, Mum. Mr. Darcy, ugh, was also there, and he has all sorts of strange ideas that I disagree with. I wonder how he will ever marry at this rate. Ha! Dear Diary, we are back home and we have a visitor, Mr. Collins, father's cousin. He is going to inherit our house one day, apparently, and he thinks he shall marry one of us because of this. He went for Jane at first. Who wouldn't? But she, of course, has Mr. Bingley. Dear Diary, I met one of Lydia's officer friends today, Mr. Wickham. He's quite charming. Darcy seems to hate him. Not that I'm surprised. Dear Diary, how terrible. It turns out that Mr. Darcy took the money that his father had promised Mr. Wickham. Gosh, he really is a horrible person. Dear Diary, Mr. Collins proposed to me. It was very embarrassing and I said no, of course. Mother will never forgive me for not marrying him, but father said he would never forgive me if I did, so it should be fine. Dear Diary, Mr. Collins is marrying my best friend Charlotte. I can't see how they can marry without love, but I don't know. Dear Diary, I seriously fear for Jane and Mr. Bingley's relationship. She hasn't heard from him in quite a while. Dear Diary, I went to visit Charlotte and Mr. Collins. Mr. Darcy was there, and he was acting very odd. Dear Diary, I heard Darcy prevented Mr. Bingley from marrying Jane. How could he do such a thing? Dear Diary, Mr. Darcy proposed to me. What? Why? After all he has done? We ended up fighting again. I shall never, ever, ever marry this man. Dear Diary, Mr. Darcy gave me a letter. Apparently, he did not cheat Wickham of his money. Wickham squandered it all off himself. And he thought that Jane was only using Mr. Bingley and that she did not love him. And he said sorry. I shall have to think all of this over. Dear Diary, sorry it has been a while. I'm visiting Darcy's estate, by accident, mind you, with aunt and uncle. I have to admit, it is quite grand. All of the people here have nothing but praise for him. I thought Darcy wasn't going to be here, but he appeared today. I felt quite embarrassed, what with all that has happened, but he was very... nice. He introduced me to his sister Georgiana, and she's such a sweet girl. Dear Diary, oh, you shall not believe what has happened. My silly little sister Lydia has gone and eloped with Mr. Wickham. Does she not understand that she could ruin us all? At least now we know what Mr. Wickham is like. Mr. Darcy blames himself for not exposing him, but it is my fault as much as his. Dear Diary, back home, chaos. I told everyone about Mr. Wickham. Father and uncle have gone to look for Lydia. Silly thing, Lydia Wickham or not. Dear Diary, thank goodness Lydia and Wickham are back. Mother is so happy that they are married, but uncle and aunt must have paid Wickham a lot for them to get married. We shall forever be in debt to them. Dear Diary, I must admit that my perception of Mr. Darcy has quite changed. Unfortunately, what with our family's embarrassment regarding Lydia and Wickham, you will probably want nothing to do with me. Dear Diary, I heard that it was Darcy that had paid for Lydia and Wickham to get married. And, dare I say it, he did this mostly for me. Dear Diary, 
Bingley and Darcy are back in town. Oh, it is so nice to see Bingley and Jane together again. I think Darcy is avoiding me. It was, of course, too much to hope. Dear Diary, Jane and Bingley are engaged. Oh, I'm so happy for them. Dear Diary, Mr. Darcy's aunt hates me and feared that I was to marry him. But even if I was, it is nothing to do with her. Diary, Mr. Darcy and I are to be married. Jane can't believe I'm in love with him. I had to persuade father as well, but he soon gave his blessing. Mother is ecstatic, of course. Dear Diary, it's strange, isn't it? How things turn out? I see my sisters often these days. Lydia and Wickham are still quite annoying. Georgiana is my dear friend now. And of course, I am happy with Mr. Darcy. Between his pride and my prejudice, who would have guessed?